right? But what we need is 100% privatization of healthcare, a complete privatization of healthcare, not tinkering with Obamacare and changing these exchanges to those exchanges. Get the government out of the way. I, I, I often ask audiences, what do you think this would, this is an iPhone, what do you think this would look like if a government committee designed it? Now everybody laughs. I, I can do this anywhere in the world, any age group, even among socialists. I ask them, what do you think this will look like if a government designed them, they laugh. Because they know it would look horrible and it would function horribly, right? Even socialists know that. Okay, now this is not that important as compared to your health. So let's give government control of our health. They can't do iPhones, but health, education, the two most important things in our entire lives, maybe, right? That we give to government. Right? Like you won't even use the post office if you can use FedEx or, or, or UPS, right? But drop your kids off at the post office every morning and let the government tinker with their brain, that's cool. Or go to a government hospital run by the post office, that's okay. I, you know, it, it, it really, you know, if markets are good enough for iPhones, they're good enough for my health care, they're good enough for education, they're good enough for pretty everything, because this, I'll tell you, this is gorgeous. And it functions brilliantly. And I want health care as good as this. I don't want to limit my, it goes back to imagination. I don't want my health care limited by some bureaucrat's imagination. And that's what we get today. That's what you have today. And I could go on and on about how rotten socialized medicine is and how destructive it is, destructive to the doctor and destructive to the patient and destructive to everybody. But I don't need to because you can experience it soon enough.